Brochures are still very, very popular in uh, tourism marketing, but are extremely costly to produce. So finding ways of making them as effective as possible is always a big challenge. Everybody considers the type of behaviors that they're going to be doing when they travel to destinations. So we thought it would be cool if we were able to look at that from a technological standpoint. What are the behaviors and the way you flip through the pages, the way that you're reading through the text? Are you looking at pictures? Are you focused on advertisements? And we're actually able to look at that on a granular level and we can use uh, software and technology to actually say, this is in fact how people are using tourism brochures. The new technologies that we are adopting, uh, one of which is eye tracking, uh, doesn't ask people their opinions, it simply tracks what they do and therefore we can see where they look and what they read and how much time they spend. All of these nuances that uh, then help us for a much better layout of the brochure. They check where you're looking on the page, they check how long you're spending there, and then it produces all kinds of statistics around those measurements. We're following it up with in-depth interviews so that afterwards we say, it would appear that this picture really attracted you, why? And get people to explain. It was a physical eye eyeglasses, similar to something you would wear that's a prescription uh, pair of glasses, but has a little camera right in the middle of it. That camera is then connected to a software tablet that we have. So on the tablet, then you would be able to watch what you're observing through those glasses that are on your face. We were actually able to map out a typology of tourism brochure users. Some people prefer to read from front to back. Some people do a quick scan of the pages and then go right back to the beginning and read it word for word. It was very, very contextual and it was very interdependent. In terms of uh, images, they were perhaps the most important aspect of the brochure in the sense that they created that discovery or they created that intrigue of the destination. What is it about that destination that image captures that you could never capture in, in a, a single paragraph on the page? With attractions, uh, museum visits, they actually would wear uh, while they are visiting a museum and so what displays are they looking at, how much time are they spending, which pieces are they looking at, are they reading the text or are they just looking at the artifact. I mean it has just a tremendous amount of diverse applications.